If you got a Holley Snapper system like I do, you know that the sensors are a huge ripoff. To add a sensor to the system, you're looking at at least $150 a pop. But you've paid enough money, so here's how to not get ripped off. So I have this 1 8 MPT port at with a 45 degree angle. And normally you buy a sensor like this with a 1 8 MPT port up to maybe 100 PSI and you'd be in business. But those are $130 each. And if you want to monitor multiple systems, that can add up real quick. And here's how you can save some money. What I have here is an ICT billet adapter going from 1 8 MPT that will fit into our block to an M16 by 1.5 oil pressure sensor. What I have here is a generic oil pressure sensor from a 2007 Chevy GMC truck. And guess what? It will fit on the block just like this. Let's go put it in. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is going to get our adapter set up. This 45 degree 1 8 MPT uh, elbow is already ready to go. Just going to add a little bit of thread seal and get it in there. The sensor is already ready to go. It's got a little bit of sealant on there and a sealant ring, a little cap to protect it, and you're good to go. So that's the next step. Now you will need a special socket to get these nice and tight, but they are cheap, and I'll put a link to them in the description below. And there you have it. So now we can get our harness connected here. We can program the Holly to read this sensor, and we're in there. So this, if you're wondering how much you saved, this adapter was $20, and this sensor was $25. So at under 60 bucks, we're definitely in the green here. Check out the description below for all the parts that I use and make sure you hit that subscribe button.